So anyway, guys, we're first of all, like I know people who are watching the show are like, Jesus Christ, it's way too many serials. This is going to be like an hour and a half. I just, I, I got to go to bed. It's too late. It's just, I mean, the name of the show is "It's Too Late" in my defense, but uh, <laughs> this is not this is not going to take anywhere near as long as the Halloween candy did because we we've, we've got a plan. Dave and I have a plan. We're going to execute the plan. Um, Bang and, it up. Yeah, <laughs> just like Mayor Pete. Am I right? <laughs> so, I think we did that. <laughs> so anyway, the same joke. Please. Yeah. So so anyway, uh, let's let's just get started here. So for folks at home, we're doing the breakfast cereal tier list. S tier means it's cereal that you, you just if you've got it in the cabinet, it's going in your belly. Mm -hmm. A, B, C, all the way down to D. D tier is probably the oh, we still have that. That's weird. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you have a half a bowl of it left in a box in the cabinet for like seven years. And then you finally check the date on it and you realize it really doesn't taste any worse than it did the first time. <laughs> um that's d tier that is... d tier right where mayor pete belongs um nothing dave all right anyway oh oh no 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 you're good uh and also the other thing we've done to make this a little bit quicker on us is is there's not that many cereals it looks like there's a lot but there's a lot of duplicates so instead of instead of ranking every different flavor of cheerios or whatever we're just going to say cheerios is a cereal and when we're ranking it we're ranking it based on the good and the bad of all the Cheerios, if that makes sense. So that's what Average. we're doing. We're starting with Apple Jacks. Dave, are you a fan of Apple Jacks? I am. I, I, I don't go after them, but when I have them, I'm, I'm pleased. I'm happy. Isn't good that the, isn't that the one with that that frog or something with the hat and the skateboard and is Apple is Jack. that no or is that no, that's 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 Sugar Smacks. One. That's Sugar Smacks. Sugar Smacks okay. is even on the list. That's weird. wow. Now, There's got to be something like it. Yeah, is it is Apple Jacks like it? Who no. cares? Anyway, Apple Jacks. I'm gonna say that it's like an Apple version of Fruit Loops. Yep. Yeah, it's like just one flavor. Yeah, Fruit, fruit Loops. Loops. Oops. Apple. Oops. No fruit. Oops. One <laughs> Fruit Loops. Fruit Loop. Singular. Um. This is already so. F We've only we haven't even done yeah. one yet. <laughs> I'm, it's just going through my head. I'm like, we're doing the thing. We're doing <laughs> Alan, you're doing the thing. All right, Apple Jacks. <laughs> for me, I'm gonna say B for now. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't, a, B, B. Yeah. Yeah, I don't rush out to get it, but you know, I don't think it's bad. Okay, yeah. so we're gonna do these together. So Boo Berry and Frankenberry. We're gonna combine those to say. So first, I don't think I've seen Boo or Frankenberry in like 30 years. It's it's gotten hot lately, and and they were out. I, I saw both of those boxes out recently. Really? Yeah. And Interesting. Frankenberry was my jam when I was a kid. Oh. Really? Yeah. Isn't that like yeah. marshmallows and stuff? Yep. See, I don't like marshmallows in breakfast cereal. I know that that's that might be criminal for some people. Oh. Now Dave and I can't work together anymore. That was no. It it, it depends on what you're trying to accomplish with your day. Yeah. So. <laughs> so Frankenberry and Booberry together. <laughs> Wait, what? What are you trying to accomplish with your day, where you have marshmallows? No, I'm. That's why I don't eat it anymore. But like I said when I when I was a kid. Now I'm like you know brand stuff, not not super brand, but yeah. Ooh, what the hell was that? Are you? You're you're hovering around C or D, and I feel like that's a that's no. Oh, you want it higher? Is but is this just nostalgia for you? Are, are you lying to have, yourself right now? <laughs> I haven't had it in decades, probably, so it's hard to say. All right, I'm gonna leave it in B because I I feel like you're looking through rosy colored glasses here. I might be. All right, Captain Crunch. Now I know what everyone's thinking. Isn't that the cereal that cuts the roof of your mouth? And you Tears up. you shut. You stop with that nonsense. It takes gonna, like half a box. To I really was going to say a bad word, stuff. but I can't ruin the only segment Dave's kids can watch. <laughs> so I I actually like Captain Crunch, like crunch berries and stuff. I like it a mm -hmm. lot. Yeah. Peanut butter crunch is awesome. I, yeah. That, that'd be my favorite. So I'm going to say it'll probably end up being low A. And then we're, so again, we're going to count all the crunches as one. So we'll just move those aside. All right. The staple Cheerios. Yeah. Now, I want to go on record. Banana Nut Cheerios is my favorite cereal of all time, and it's not even close. 
and I've already told the story on the show <laughs> that it's a limited time thing and they've ruined my life and I need a fix. If anyone has mm. banana nut Cheerios, please send them to me. That sounded really yeah. desperate. <laughs> yeah. I also love apple cinnamon Cheerios. Mm -hmm. And of course, honey nut. Honey nut Cheerios with bananas? Mm. So I don't for, know. I don't know where to put it, but like regular Cheerios kind of drags it down a little. Well, yeah. I mean, just cheer like nobody. Only babies eat Cheerios, and that's because parents are terrible. <laughs> They're feeding their baby just whole grain trash. So yeah, I'm gonna say. Yeah. I mean, in my opinion, Cheerios is S tier because it's it's like the staple. But if you think we should put it in A tier for now, we can. That would be the compromise. Like I, I can't put it in S. Yeah. All right. So we'll move the Cheerios out of the way. See, we're we're moving along, guys. You're yeah, not going to be good. here until eleven forty-five. It's fine. <laughs> All right. Checks. Checks. The only time I eat that is when Mary makes me buy all the boxes so in the holidays, so she can make the checks mix, and then we have to eat what's left over. Hmm. So it's not is, bad. I like how this is but, becoming a Dave and Mary segment all of a sudden. Slowly taking over. It's all right, Mary. Just bring up the Queens. Just have Queens Gambit playing in the background tomorrow night when you're watching <laughs> the show. Um, I think I've only had checks once in my life. Wow. And I and I and I ate it, and I said to myself, "That happened." Mm -hmm. It's very yeah. Yep, that's fun. I mean, it doesn't go into D because it, it doesn't literally make me projectile vomit. No. Okay. But they also have like the blueberry checks and like strawberry checks, but I've I've never had those. Those don't yeah. go in checks mix. So. Well, I, I don't think the checks should mix. So. Um. Now, okay. Now this one's going to be controversial. I think cinnamon toast oh. crunch. There's some people out there that love them. Some cinnamon mm -hmm. toast crunch. I don't mm -hmm. love cinnamon toast crunch. I think it's kind of bland. I just lost really? my entire audience when I said that. I know. I'm sorry. Um, and, see, yeah, I've never had the French toast crunch. Anna Kay loves cinnamon toast crunch, so she's yeah. just, she's gonna leave me. That was this is it. So. Cinnamon toast crunch is like an event for me. It's like oh wow. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I don't think it's like, again, it's not like I'm saying it's bad, but I, I never eat it because I, I just am not impressed. So, but you think it's amazing. Would you be okay putting it like in front of Captain Crunch? Yeah, I. Okay. Because I, 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 it's like top two, three for me. I'm going to, I'm going to defend the Captain's Honor later on in the, in the list. Uh, Cocoa <laughs> Puffs. Are you cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, Dave? Yeah. So I think Cocoa no. Puffs are okay, but I think there's other chocolate cereals that are better. Mm -hmm. So that's why it goes in the C, but above Chex. Because yeah, it has yeah. a flavor on the box. Yep. It's chocolate. Uh, Cookie Crisp. Cookie Crisp is the one with that that dog that's like, I don't know, cuckoo for Cookie Crisp. Every single cereal is cuckoo but, for insert name here. They're, they're, they're always yelling, Cookie Crisp. But oh, was it always the dog? I, I think so, because it's like a dog howling. Like, Ooh, okay. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah. This is what people are really tuned in for. It's, <laughs> it's our impressions of the mascots of the breakfast cereal. <laughs> we're we're going to do all the old school commercials. We're going to end up separating this list into cereals with mascots and cereals without mascots. <laughs> all right. I think Cookie Crisp just basically is totally forgettable. Really? Yeah. Like I, I would never eat it. I it, mean, if I, I just wanted I, to go get some cookies and pour milk yeah. over them and eat them, I would. There, there, it hit hard. Like as a kid, going, oh, "Well, I'm eating cookies for breakfast," you know. And it, and again, you get that nostalgia thing. So yeah. I haven't had them in a long time. See, yeah. All right, they still go above checks because there's yeah. it. <laughs> Kellogg's cornflakes. Mm. It's. It's cornflakes that are not as healthy as the healthy cornflakes. It's not as good as the good cornflakes. They just exist. Yep. They you hope they won't kill you as a an adult. Pops. I kind of like pops. Yeah, I haven't had them in a long time. 
it, it's been a while for me too, but they do have, it's not just sugar. Like they kind of have like a unique, almost like honey type of a flavor. Yeah. Yep. Um, and they're good and they are pops and they, they're relatively <laughs> crunchy even, even when they're in milk. So I don't know. They exist. Put them up here. Maybe count okay. chocula. So chocolate cereal, but also with marshmallows. Marsh- if you're, yeah. If you're if you're into what Mayor Pete's into, you're into that. Um, See, that's part of the the blueberry, Frankenberry trifecta. Is it? Would you consider? So that's part of the same. Kind of. Like, yeah, I'd, I'd probably put them next to each other. I feel like Count Chocula had a had a longer shelf life than Booberry. Yeah, did. It, he stuck around, and it, I feel like the yeah. other two kind of fell. Well, off. it's well, it's because he's the undead. So <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. And that but chocolate I mean, hits. I mean, I guess Frankenberry is too. So. The cereals where you get the chocolate milk afterwards, that's always nice. Yeah. But I think other cereals have better chocolate. So I'm going to put it below Cocoa Puffs. Mm, okay. What the hell are Kellogg's Cracklin' Oat Bran? That's, uh, that's cardboard. I'm pretty sure. All right. Yeah. Um, I didn't even realize they make this. They make Eggo Waffle Cereal. I don't know if I've seen that. Never had it. Can't judge it. It's going to be better than. Yeah, it's so the top of D is cereals we're it's not sure amazing. about, but mm-hmm. not cardboard. Okay, Fruit Loops. I put them honestly. I put them under Apple Jacks. Follow your nose, Dave. Yeah. It always knows. Yeah. So first of all, Fruit but Loops. Fruit Loops are amazing. How do you feel? Wow, I okay. think Fruit Loops are one of the, like if you if you're gonna give your baby some like round, whole grain, but you really want them to die at six years old of diabetes, you give yeah. them Fruit Loops. Yeah, yeah, Fruit Loops is kind of like abortion if you think about it. Later. Yeah, late. Yeah, well, I mean they legalize <laughs> that now, so I mean for me, Fruit Loops are S tier, but if that's like. If that's if that's not good for you, I'll put them down here with cinnamon toast crunch. Yeah, I love Fruit Loops. Yeah. Fruit Loops are. We we can shuffle it later because okay. we'll figure out if we actually agree what S tier is. Frosted Flakes are they great, Dave? They're pretty good. I like Frosted Flakes. I'll admit, um, I've had a lot of Frosted Flakes also with bananas, and I've also had Frosted Flakes <laughs> where there are already flakes that are frosted. Sorry. And then I'll actually pour like seven pounds of sugar on the on the bowl of Frosted Flakes. Yeah. Oh, on. Yeah. That's a lot of sugar. Like if yeah. you're, yeah. I mean, go big or go home. So <laughs> we're doing this. Yeah. So in my mind, Frosted Flakes are good. They're not as good as um, Fruit Loops, though. That feels right. Yeah. All right. Frosted Mini Wheats slash Mini Wheats. Strawberry. Yeah. Um. See, regular mini wheats would drag it down. You can't. That's just yeah. So okay. So frosted mini wheats. Yeah. Still, I I I would assume the Eggo waffles are better. They're better. Well, actually, they're, they're probably better than corn flakes because you get that little that little sugar kick. Yes, I think they're better than checks. Because so, I mean, checks are yeah. frosted mini wheats without the frosting and without the wheat, mm-hmm. and without the made for human consumption. <laughs> so, sometimes i gotta i gotta let the mini wheat soak though you know it yeah. takes a while to totally absorb and soften up yeah i mean unless you like them crunchy that'd be a thing yeah golden crisp um okay what, what were we talking about earlier the the sugar sugar snaps or whatever yeah i think that's that's kind of the same so I never really cared for Golden Crisp. They always they always just had a weird flavor to me. Yeah. Like you know how like Pops is like a little round cereal, but it kind of has like a sweet honey type flavor. Yeah. I always felt like Golden Crisp was the same thing, but bad. I'm trying to remember it. Like they're like little little sticky like little balls, right? Well, not yeah, they're not yeah. They're they're little, they're they're Mare Pete's Mare Pete's Golden Crisp. Um. Yeah, <laughs> is that him on the box? Yeah, that's it. That's him. That's Mayor Pete right there. So, I mean, for me, Golden Crisp are basically 
D tier for me. I mean, I'm putting it below Ego because again, we really have no idea. Yeah, <laughs> Ego could be amazing. Golden Grams. I thought Golden Grams were just like cracker cookies that you eat. I didn't realize you also ate them in cereal. We got those recently, and there's some kind of like off aftertaste. I don't, I don't think it was just uh, the box. There's something weird about them. Uh, well, you go down here with your sticky balls then. <laughs> um, honey bunches of oats. Now, now as we're... an adult, I, I like those a lot. Okay, all right. So this is like this is like the bizarro blueberry then for you. This is yeah. <laughs> That's what I would go after now if I wanted to like get something done today but still have a little cereal in the morning. Okay. All right. Um I- I'm going I'm going to be I'm going to be ironic here and put it next to frankenberry. <laughs> so that it can it can have a it can have an ideological war in your mind later. Um <laughs> honeycomb. I used to eat honeycomb when I was a kid. Yeah. I to it, right off the bat, I think it would be kind of the same as pops, like just yes. a different shape. Yes, it's. I think it's a little. It's less flavorful than pops. Um, okay. I'm gonna put it over here. I'm gonna put it below your your internal struggle. Um, go lean. We're just gonna. There you go. That's fine. Yeah. Uh, kicks. Did you ever eat and, kicks? Yeah, I've had them, and it's. Another thing that you'd give a baby if, if you didn't want it to be Cheerio shaped. I, yeah, I feel like Kix is what people who eat pops eat when <laughs> they think that that flavor was made by the devil. Like you, you can't have that much sugar because it'll ruin your good Christian household. Yeah. So you eat Kix mm-hmm. instead. Yep. Um. So it's it's probably gonna go down here. I think it's it's not literally poured into the garbage, but you know. Like the Amish eat kicks. So <laughs> they make it. Um yeah. Kellogg's crave. What how are we doing on time, by the way? This is your uh, Dave! Jesus I'm... Christ! Oh my I... god. Alright. No 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 no. Just don't even look. It's too late now. Alright, okay. Kellogg's Crave, uh D. Uh Life. Oh, that's good. It's it's a treat. Oh, life, yeah. I love life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what about the cereal? <laughs> that's a... oh. Um I'm gonna put it up here. Okay, without sugar, it's a little. But even with sh- without sugar, it's still pretty sweet. Okay, that's fine. I All love right. life. Uh, life lucky Charms. Take one. When you, when you wanna when you wanna wake up that little mech inside you, you get Lucky Charms. Um, it's it's a kid's cereal. That, like I can't see eating yeah, it. As it's an all adult. marshmallows for God's sakes. Yeah. It's all. It's. I'd rather eat. Up. I I'd rather eat little waffles and milk. Um, you can put Cinnabon right next to the waffles for me. I don't, I don't know Cin- anything about yeah, it. Yeah, so, so okay. So this whole line right here, if you're eating Cinnabon, Eggos, Donuts, Donuts. Oreos, and Chips Ahoy for in your I'm cereal. I'm sure they're great. So first yeah. of all, you're lying to yourself. Just go get the real ones and pour it in a bowl for all I care. And second of all, Wilford Brimley will meet you at the gates of hell. Um <laughs> Cocoa Pebbles and Fruity Pebbles combined into one. So I actually think Cocoa Pebbles make the best chocolate milk. Okay, yeah, I agree. And Fruity um, Pebbles is S tier for me. You know what? Let's do that. Well, you, you know what? Screw you guys. Pop, okay, Pop-Tarts, that goes in there too. Yep. Jesus Christ, you guys. Um, Raisin Bran. That's like the best cereal you could get if your parents didn't want to give you the sugary cereal. Yeah. Yeah, so if you're if you weren't loved as a child, you ate raisin bran. You might you might thank your parents today for letting you live a good long life, but you also resent them. <laughs> so bottom of C. Um oh, okay. Reese Puff okay, that's just Jesus. Guys, just go eat just eat Reese Cups for breakfast. I don't care. Do 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 Those are like peanut butter or cocoa puffs, yeah. Yeah. Um uh, Rice Krispies and Cocoa Rice Krispies. So cocoa rice krispies are literally cocoa pebbles with slightly less chocolate, and rice yeah. krispies are small checks. But they make sound. Yes, they're they're yeah, checks they're with sound. Um, <laughs> go somewhere like in here, maybe. Um, s'mores. What? What the? Yeah. I know that there's people oh, out there that man. don't like cereal that are like, "This is all candy." No, these are literally candy. <laughs> Sour Patch Kids cereal? What? I've heard of it. I've never tried it. 
Okay, and the opposite of Sour Patch Kids cereal is Special K. Yeah. Yep, that's with the uh, that cashy for me. Yeah. So Special K is like Raisin Bran for people who only want the love of Christ in their lives. <laughs> that, so is that what it takes? Yeah. Uh, tricks. So tricks is Fruit Loops, but instead of it being Fruit Loops, yeah. it's just fruit shapes. Circle. Oh yeah. Oh, they used to be circle. They're, they're I think they're not as sugary as Fruit Loops. Um. Up a little. Yeah. Okay. All right. Sure. Uh, oh, waf yeah. Waffle Crisp. Mm. Might as well put it with the Eggos. I don't know. All right. All right. It's last one. Last one because we got to get it. People are going to be like, what happened to the last five minutes? All right. Uh, Wheaties. You got to get your Wheaties. You know where you can get it? Right there. Yep. The trash. Yeah. And these are and all then... just repeats. We're not going to do those. Guys, we're going to be back. Let me let me get the hell out of here. Oh, God, this is we can't do these tier lists anymore. Jesus Christ. <laughs>